guys, and welcome back to Neverwinter the Open Beta. Um, in the previous episode, we went through the tutorial, I guess, for the game, the starting area, which is pretty cool. We learned some cool abilities, and we ended up here when I ended the video. And I guess this has to be the first major town that you get into or something. There's a lot of players around. But, um, I'm an honest fighter. yeah, in this video, we're going to talk a little bit about what I like about this game and what I dislike. Now, first off, I'm going to talk about what I dislike about the game so far, which isn't a whole lot. I dislike the whole that you can't use your mouse wheel to scroll in and out. You can't you cannot zoom further out or in if you want to. Uh, unless it's in the options. I don't think there's a field of view in there. Let's go in there and check options And that would have to be on the video uh, Field of view Maybe I'm missing it terrain details Ah, Here's the distance character Detail distance. Maybe that's it. I'm not sure. Let's try to crank it up. It was at a hundred. Let's click apply. Nothing's happening. Let's turn that down again. So that was not it. Character detail. No, no, that's not it. Screen space. Nope. There's nothing. So th that's that's one thing I dislike about it. If you wanted to zoom out to have a better overview, you cannot do that. That's basically so far. I like the combat system. It's it's actually a little more. It's a little faster than what we've seen in both Terra and in Raiders, which is something I really like because with those games, the combat seemed a little slow. Whereas in this, it's it's a lot faster. And that's good and the fact that it's faster you can just you know end and your, your your combo attacks or whatever you should call them and then move out of the way by sprinting like that I'm having some frame issues in here in the in the major town here um, but that's expected I guess since there's only three servers to pick from but um so let's talk about what I do like I like the combat system a whole lot I like the uh, but there's nothing here. Uh, how do I get into the talent tree again? It has to be up here. Or if it even is a talent tree, what is this? Game support. Auction broker. So we know there's an auction house. Obviously, there's a guild thing, social tab. Uh, quest journal. Send market. Shop in there, bra bra bra. I don't know. What is this? Astral Diamond Exchange to buy and sell Astral Diamond. I don't know. Homepage and the character status. Maybe it's in here. So this is currently the gear edit profile. I don't want to do that. Powers. Here it is. So this is what we have so far. Oh, here's the feats they were talking about in one of the racials. Uh, not the one we have though, but in one of the other ones. Oh. It goes a far way down. Jesus Christ. We have some unspent points as well. Let's let's have a look at that. But I like this. I like this so far. It looks nice and neat and mighty what? Available at five points. Can I spend five points to get that? I cannot. Why can I not? Oh, points spent, points available, zero. That's how it works, okay. So these points have been auto-spent for me, I guess. Feats. Let's go in here. What is this? We can't put... Oh, I can move it around. We don't have anything to put in here. What is this? Oh, hang on. So there's uh, three different classes underneath this from the looks of it. This is so damn cool. I like this. 
we're gonna have a look at all this in another video at some point but I like this this is something I really like companions I don't really care about that unless they fight for you or something I don't know but I don't know this must be some like sub trees or something you can get into And this is like the end thing you get. Destroy his purpose. You now gain determination by dealing damage and unstoppable. Also increases the in what encounter power damage by 12%. It probably has something to do with all this other shit. Let me see the tooltip. Thank you very much. Whenever an ally within f what? a view is hit, you gain a stack of vengeance. Each stack of uh, increases power by ten percent. Stacks up to five times. That's pretty cool. Nice. Oh, so you can just click here in case I had something in my bags. Let's see with the boots, because I had extra boots. Uh, where are the boots at? Here they are. So they would s here they are. But these ones have, have actual stats on them. Defense. Nice. Something I like as well. And like, like we, I mentioned in the first video, that you can actually rearrange everything. You can move everything around as you see fit. I don't know what the point is by having this one, the self status, to be honest. But, um. I don't think there's a mute NPC voice. I don't think there's a point to having this one out, even. Let's just hide it for now. Because we disabled that, and that's another cool thing. I like the fact that they enabled the option to actually go into the um, audio and disable the, uh, the mute voice after dialogue. So they don't keep talking on after you're done, after you, you know, you're done with, with the NPC. I like that as well. Overall, I think this game has presented itself really well. And, um, yeah, I'm, I'm very impressed with it so far. I really like what they've done with it. I really do. The graphics as well, I might add. I mean, the graphics look really, really good in this game. I don't know how well it's going to show on YouTube, though, because of encoding and stuff like that, but still. This is very much enjoyable. I can see myself having a lot of fun playing this game. Maybe this game is actually going to be what Raiders didn't get to be. Because I feel like Raiders was one of them games... Some people might, there, there's probably going to be some people that are going to argue with me in this one. I don't really care. But Raiders really did fail. It really did fail. So many things they, they I mean, they rushed that release on that game. This game actually feels like this could be what Raiders never got to be. And then there's some, some people might say, well, Raiders can still become that. Yeah, but then it's too late. Because they rushed the release on it. Now this game's come out, or, well, it's basically come out. What, who do I need to talk to? This guy with the blue thing, what is that? Sergeant Knox. Let's talk to him. Protectors Enclave needs your help. Yeah, <laughs> goodbye, Sergeant. <laughs> let's do that. No, let's not. Wilfred is dead. Damnation. Too young to go out like that. <sighs> I want to thank you for what you did on the bridge. We might have lost Protector's Enclave if the Harbinger breached the walls. Please, look at the chest behind me for a token of my appreciation. Oh, thank you very much. Goodbye, Sergeant. Have a look at that chest of yours. Oh, there's the new sword, yes. So let's have a look at the actual, let, if, the, if it's, you know, there's actual different skins to the weapons as well. So let's have a look at our tune from behind here. That did not sound right, to be honest. 
But let's let's have a look at it and then equip the sword. Actually, it doesn't seem like it looks all that different. What was so different about that sword, to be honest? This one had... Oh, so it's gonna show me. The other one had a lot more damage. And it has plus 25 power on it. Oh, I wonder if we're gonna deal like a good trillion damage now. And then we can talk to him again. Let's do that, Sergeant Knox. Protector's Enclave needs your help. Yes, I know. Oh, we lost a lot of good people today. And the harbinger appearing so close to the walls does not bode well for the safety of the Enclave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's complete. What is this? Rags? I understand you lost quite a few of your belongings when the ship you were on was destroyed by the Dracolich. I can't offer you much, but I can supply you with some off-duty clothing. I'm sure you're going to want to relax and get out of your combat gear at some point. Talk to Supply Sergeant Queen. He's just west of here, through that tunnel. Get out of my combat gear. Okay, so what's that up beside the minimap? What the hell is that? Is that something I can queue up for? Professions, skirmishes, finish the skirmish within the event, of blah, 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 okay, arena PvP, okay, it's the five on five arenas gather, how do I do that? Done. How do I enter the arena? I want to know. Is there something up here? Please tell me that something's been added up here so I can actually... Social... Send market. I don't care. What is that? Nope. Nope. Homepage. There's probably nothing under... What's this in the profile? Oh, that's just that. How the hell do I do that? Oh, H just does that. I have no idea how that works. We're just going to continue on here. Maybe it's going to lead us to where we... I should figure out how to do these things. Or M. Have a look at the map. God damn it. Oh, you can zoom in and everything, and it's gonna show you. And they're marked over here. Nice. Auction broker. Sergeant Knox. Quests. Nice. Is there anything that says anything about arena? Guild registry. Probably gonna end up making a guild in this game, guys. If you wanna join, feel free to come online. I want the server Dragon. And then the name is Save Them All. She just sent me a tell. Uh, auction broker. There's nothing here. Unless it's some of this weird ass stuff that I don't know what it is. Hall of Justice. Alright, well, let's just move on. Let's find the guy we need to talk to. This guy. Hello, adventurer. Hello. I heard about what happened on the bridge. Why did you? stopped the harbinger. Yes. And we get another chest. Amazing. Just get handed free shit. So I have to select one of these, I guess. The peasant tunic. Your fellow citizens. Donate now. Okay. That's the for the body and then there's Oh I get both of them, I, I guess. Press C to open the character sheet. 
Why is there no voiceover for this? Click the fashion button. Where's that? Whoa! whoa, whoa. Where did the fashion button go? Is that... What? Support your fellow citizen. Donate now. Hang on, can I do all these? No, I cannot. This is the main hand, okay. Um... Where's the fashion button? Is that... That's the fashion button. There you go. And then... There you go. Do I have anything for the head? No, I do not. Do I then have the chest underneath? Where's my sword at? Oh, there it is. Aha! It's magic! Okay, game, where am, where am I supposed to go? Hmm. Well, that way. GG, same all. GG. I'm having quite the frame drops in here, but as you can see, guys, this is not a completely unpopular game. There are people all over the place. Ah, we need to talk to the sergeant again. Sergeant Knox, I'm back. Protectors Enclave needs your help. Yes, we know. You're back. Yes. Good. I have some more work for you if you're interested. You have a keen eye, Sergeant Knox. I'm back. If you want to see more videos from this game, by the way, guys, if you want to see me continue doing other stuff in this game, or with this game, let me know in the comments, please. Uh, the theft of the crown. I've gotten a report about some disturbances in the vaults beneath the Hall of Justice. The guards are spread thin after the last attack, but you've proven yourself more than capable. Would yes, like I have. Ask... Let's, let's go take care of that. But that's going to happen at some other time. Guys, we've talked about what I like and what I dislike about this game. Basically, overall, I enjoy this a lot. And the fact that it's a free-to-play game, and it presents itself so well, like with the with the, um, the opening cutscene, that looked so amazing. I mean, there's been a lot of things put into this game, considering it's a free-to-play game. So, overall, I'm thinking this is, this is going to be really, really good. So far, I'm, I'm liking it, but... I, I can't say what's going to happen later on in the game. So this has just been the first impressions kind of thing. My first impressions of the game and what I think of it so far. And I think if you are a fan of this type of games, you should definitely get the open beta installed or even the game if you watch this after the game has come out and it's not an open beta anymore. Get it installed. It's free to play. Get yourself an educated opinion about the game. This is just my opinion about the game. That doesn't mean that everyone else should think that it's good or bad. But, um, but yeah, get yourself an opinion about the game. And, you know, it, it's not going to cost you anything other than time. So uh, so get the game installed. Let's see if there's, uh, there's emotes before I, I end the video. Slash dance. You cannot dance. Did you meant emote wave? Yeah, let's wave. And then turn the camera around and then bye guys I'm the half orc can I then do it like that yes I can again bye guys I'm the half orc simple thanks for watching guys take care have fun see you all in the next one